I would tell someone who is newly diagnosed that you can beat this. It is not a death sentence. After my surgery, which was in January, I participated in the um, Race for the Cure breast cancer walk that fall. And I was so moved by the women who were 5, 10, 15, 20, 30, 40 year survivors of breast cancer. And I'm thinking to myself, wow, if I even know a woman, one of my classmates' mother, she was in her 70s and she had shared with me, you know, she said, Phyllis, I went through this by myself. I had five kids. My children did not even know until they were adult kids that I even had breast cancer. And here I am, 60 years later, still living, still going on, still moving. And so that was, that was really motivation and encouragement for me. And it helped me to become my own advocate of sorts, to advocate for my well-being and not to feel as though it was the end of the world or that, you know, as in my community, when you say the C word, it's like a death sentence. So I was determined that that was not going to be my plot. So I would tell anyone who was diagnosed that you can beat this. It's all a, a, a mind set. It's a state of mind. It's, it's, it's a will. And, 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 and the willpower to want to live and to want to prevail and to want to succeed and overcome. And that comes with self-worth, self-value, and being your own advocate.